Hello. Today I'll be talking about movie review number 37. And this movie is called Kong. Star Island. Kong Star Island is a 2017 film directed by Jordan Ford Roberts. Jordan Ford Roberts directed the film um, I think that's how you pronounce his name. Um, I saw this movie on July 19th, 2020 at the Showcase Cinema Deluxe in Springdale, Ohio. And I loved it. 10 out of 10. So this represents the second installment in the Monsterverse series that Warner Bros. Pitcher started with in 2014 with Godzilla. So, Tom's Island is about a group of scientists, military officers, travel to Skull Island to try to find some new life forms they haven't detected before. Although, things go good until they encounter Kong, a giant ape that, even though is destructive, can also be peaceful. And throughout the film, he's not as bad as, as he seems. He does have a good side. So, in other words, some of the people in the movie think he's bad, even though he's just and he's just some uh, creature that just wants to protect his homeway. I mean, that makes sense. Um, so these people have to escape Skull Island before anything any anything else bad happens. So this was very, very good. And I really liked how they did this film. Like, let me put it this way. King Kong is not, and I repeat, not the villain in the film. Um, I won't detail the villain because it's kind of really a spoiler. Okay. Some of the humans are sort of the villain, per se. Another villain is Skullcrawlers. They're like enemies of the island. But I'll let you guys see it for yourself to find out. Um, I did see this movie back in 2017 at the Regal Cinemas in Deerfield, but I wanted to see this again, especially since there will be an upcoming movie called Godzilla vs. Kong. Now this would be interesting because in Kong's story when I saw how powerful King Kong is, but I also saw how powerful Godzilla is in the Godzilla films. By the way, there was an end credit scene for Kong Star Island, just to let you guys know. But anyway, Godzilla vs. Kong, the movie that will be coming out next year in 2021, will be interesting because Supposedly, from what I've been hearing, there's been some debate on the other Godzilla vs. Kong movie that, the, that they made like in the 1900s, like I think David Shiro was. But yeah, people were divided between who actually won the battle. Some people thought Godzilla won the battle, some people thought Kong, King Kong won the battle. So there was some debate. And according to the director of this new movie, he said that the audience reading the video or reading the movie can say, okay, there was a winner. There is a winner. So there will be a winner according to the director. I don't know how it will go, but at least we'll see, okay, this creature, this creature won over the other creature. But we'll see. It's going to be awesome. So that was another reason why I wanted to see Kong Star Island, so it would help me prepare to see Godzilla vs. Kong. 
But anyway, that's my movie review of Colin Star Island. Go check this out, guys. It is really, really awesome. My next movie review will be about Iron Man. Stay tuned.